Hi again, Unlicensed Thinkers. Today I want to talk about the antidote for depression, or the opposite of depression, which actually works out to be the antidote for depression. Or at least it has been for me. I've been depressed plenty in my life. I don't really have that problem anymore. I assume it could come back, but probably not. I have a different way of thinking about things now, so not really an issue. So when you focus on um, bad things in your life, you know, say you have a, a, a cup or something and you fill that cup up with depression and all these bad things and all these horrible things. And on the other side of that, when you focus on what's good in your life, you fill that cup up with joy and happiness. And so it's not really joy and happiness that are the opposite of, um, depression. They're just sort of a result of getting rid of the depression. Um, gratitude is what is the opposite of depression. So they really can't exist in the same place, meaning about the same topics or um, when there's an abundance of gratitude, there's no room for depression. They're, they're opposites. They're they just, they simply can't be in the same place. They're like um, oil and water or Yoko Ono and the Beatles. <laughs> so when you pour more of your preference into this cup, you fill it up and you don't leave room for the other one to be there. And so like the oil and water, you know, if you fill it up with oil, there's no room for the water. If you fill it up with water, it pushes the oil out. <laughs> yes, I, I did take science classes when I was a kid, and I do know that oil floats on top of water, generally speaking. And so <laughs> we will think of depression as oil and gratitude as water. So if your cup is full of all of this oil and you want to get rid of it, you can just pour water into it and it will push that oil out of the way. It will push that depression out of that cup and leave only the water. So that's what you want to do. You think about all of these positive things. You can always think of positive things. You can think of anything to be grateful for. You know, I've said this in other videos, but the fact that you're able to watch a video on YouTube is amazing. Um, the fact that you're, that you're being taken care of in, in the respect that you have lived as long as you have lived. So, I mean, there's a million things out in the universe that could kill you and they haven't. So you can be grateful for that. You can be grateful for, um, your favorite Thing that you enjoy playing with, a pet, a family member, it doesn't matter what, um, air, uh, that you woke up this morning, that all of the amazing things that came together in this universe for you to be you and to wake up is just an amazing thing. So think of all these things to be grateful for. Be grateful for as many things as you can and let that gratitude push that stupid oil of depression out of that cup. And if you're really desperate for something to be grateful for, you can be grateful for how depressed you are. <laughs> because it means that you see your personal value, your worth as higher than what is happening in your life right now. And that is something to be respected. When you can see yourself as valuable, then you are already on the right track. And so the fact that you are depressed means that you see yourself as more valuable so you can be grateful for your depression, which will ironically kick some of the depression out of that cup and out of your life. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I love hearing from you. Be sure to hit like and share the video. Have a great day.